Hey, what up, y'all? I figured we'd jump back in where we left off. I was talking about how um, my compositions for the album that I'm working on now is um, a lot of it's inspired by the way temples are built. And, um, you know, I was showing you how these um, squares that are called yantras have these diagrams that have um, cosmological connections and, and how that's used as the foundation for temple building. And I shot, thought I would actually show you what a yantra is. This is a copper plate that has the Navagraha, which are the nine planets from, this is from the Hindu tradition. Um, I only use these as, as examples, um, you know, for anybody that's of different faith. Um, I'm, I'm looking at this more from the mystics perspective and, um, you know, dealing with angles and dealing with geometry. So, you know, it's never to offend, it's only to teach and to build energetic bridges of understanding, you know, throughout these cultures. So. <clears throat> Pardon me, I just wanted to say that for anybody out there. So yeah, back to the situation at hand. So like, yeah, we have a copper plate. I remember when I was in um, electronics class, when I was in junior high school, um, we used copper plates like this to, to make circuits. So, you know, I'm like bringing all this stuff into context and, and kind of like um, showing you how like all these different puzzle pieces in my life, you know, kind of played and, and turned into what I'm doing now. <clears throat> so, you know, what is a yantra, so, you know, I always like to have the books, you know, to, to fact check. And um, so it says, yantra, instrument, tool, a geometrical diagram believed to possess mystical powers and employed as a tool to help in meditation. All deities have their specific yantra into which they descend. <clears throat> so this is a diagram that pulls down spiritual energy from the cosmos, is basically what we're saying. And this is the foundation for temples. You know, so I'm like, well, and I was showing you that black square that's in the center of the diagram represents like the void that's bringing down this energy. So I was like, I want to correlate that to music. But I did want you guys to know that there was like a, a full story and narrative on, on why I went this route because I was learning about circuit design and I'm for whatever reason interested in, in temples and temple building and I'm like wow <laughs> now I'm learning like the foundation of a temple is a circuit you know we're dealing with copper we're dealing you know a lot of times with quartz crystal circuit you know you look at the computer you're dealing with silicon that's that's quartz crystal you're dealing with copper circuits you know again <laughs> it's it's a very similar environment so I'm like you know, if all these things have a correlation, my music as well should be in line with this lineage, you know, because, um, you know, as I say, as above, so below, or if you look at fractals, you know, you blow them up or you zoom in, you'll still find that same pattern. So if, you know, if I can look at a microchip and see this circuit, that looks like, you know, when I look at the diagram of a temple, I see this circuit. I too, you know, what I'm creating should, should be in resonance with that 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 um pattern you know so yes yeah, wanted to, to tell you about the origin of that so then that gets to um what some of you might think is my logo which is actually um what you would call a yantra or a sigil or a geometric diagram that pulls down energy which um i have this stamp here you can't really see that but i'll show you the actual you can see it's made up of triangles and um, yeah I'll, I'll break this down to you as well just so you can see that but like my whole mission with this whole voltage controller attribute that I use and using yantras you know it all started with this geometry so I'm gonna go in depth about that and then we can get back to the temple building because it all starts with the star coordinates the shapes and the geometry so yeah thanks for listening and um, yeah I'll tap back in with y'all peace